Uh, she's uh, with the show on, well, on Friday nights. World's yeah. Funniest Fails. Yes. Um, it's a it's a pretty good show. It is a good show. <laughs> it's it's good old family fun, you know, with people getting. Let's take a look at the clip because we're always yes. laughing at those clips. Yes. Jamie. Yes. What's your favorite? Warning, Grandma Flammable. <laughs> I just love. He's got the TV going. She's got fruit over here. She's got a lot, you know, a lot of different things cooking. Uh, she has a flame ring around her arm. <laughs> the flame was like a perfect circle. I know. <laughs> it was like, it's like a superhero. Oh I was going to say, oh my God. And then she slowly moves out of the room. She's like, nope, got to go feed the cat. <laughs> wow. Was she okay? <laughs> I hope so, guys. I really hope so. She seemed like a good, a good grandma just trying to yeah, make a meal for the third family. third-degree burns. That, that right, like, right. It looks like me in the kitchen, you know, all the, all the pots, everything thrown around everywhere. Oh, yeah. I'm a nightmare in the kitchen. I have, like, egg in my hair. Like, I'm a total <laughs> creep when I cook. So is this sort of, like, ridiculousness? Yeah, it is. Um, I think that, like... Uh, clip shows, as they're called, like, you know, mm -hmm. where it's videos from the internet. I always think that it's kind of like a tried and true formula where mm -hmm. people just like to see people doing dumb stuff. Or just getting <laughs> hurt, like this. Yeah. Okay. Oh. oh. You know, I mean. It's like, How do you not know that this is going to end in, ow, a, in a fail? Ow. Yeah, and there's, I think there's a culture around this. Like, people are excited to try things on camera and then, you know, fail at them. There and is a culture. En and we enjoy it. it, it I love laughing at in it. In Boston, when they had the, you know, this huge snowfall and people yes. are jumping, doing flips in the snow and landing in the snow, and the mayor comes forward and just says, you know what, knock it off. Someone's going to get hurt. <laughs> knock it off. Ow. Does it, you know, encourage people to go and do dumb things, you know, and someone might get hurt? Or I'm sure. I'm sure that there are plenty of people who uh, have seen, like, you know, ridiculousness, world's funniest, whatever it is, and they've been like, oh, I have a good idea. I'm going to, you know, do something crazy in my front yard. So. Why is, why is it that you think that it's funny when people get hurt like that? You know, I falls are always funny. Falls are always funny. It's because it's unexpected. I don't want anybody to get really hurt, but no, they no, are no. Funny. You want to you want to make sure that they right now, yeah, that would be he'd hilarious. laugh, right? He'd really laugh, laugh. <laughs> and they would be like, "Are you okay?" But also, that but was also, hysterical. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. I think that. Um, wait, what was the first question? <laughs> why are falls funny? <laughs> right. <laughs> um, I think that they're funny because it's actually like the only punchline that mm. isn't written. Mm -hmm. Like you really are not. You don't know what's mm. going to happen. Like, you literally see someone just, you know. I think it's also because it's at the expense of another person. Oh, because absolutely. you falling, well, it I, makes I you might feel, laugh at myself it if makes I you fell, feel like a, It makes you feel like you've better. got your life together. Better. Yeah, absolutely. I wouldn't trip like that, of course. Yeah. No, <laughs> so I'm So when you look at the class. videos, you analyze it and you have to come up with some kind of, you know, shtick or what see, do you I do? See, I think it should be a yeah. game show because you, someone should win for the it best. It is, it know. is, oh it is. No, 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 they have a game show element which is what mm -hmm. makes it really fun because you're you're watching the clips more closely to make sure that you're picking out like the funniest observations and then, yeah, and then you're, mm -hmm. you are competing actually. <laughs> so today I saw Terry Crews at the gym. I didn't say oh anything to him. You know, you just leave him alone. He looked really. He's such a hunk. He looked so serious. Oh yeah. So mean. Oh yeah. yeah. And I he's, know that he, I know like in person okay. he probably teddy is like. Bear, teddy bear on the inside muscles on the outside. Mm -hmm. my favorite Perfect type of person. Perfect combination. Yeah, literally my favorite type of person. <laughs> He's, he, you, he looks like he could like pick you up and throw no, he, you. He was like Godzilla style. Ripped and I, and I yeah. watched him run. He was running like oh. like a madman. It was like interesting when he runs. I see him as more of just a heavy yes. lifter and then yeah. go home. I was shocked. Okay. I loved. He was like he was on four miles. Yeah. I oh, like, I would be. Dang. Yeah. I, this guy's a machine. Yeah. He he is a machine. I mean, he's he's probably he's like the closest thing to like a real like a, a real life superhero, mm -hmm. in my mind. He's like got it all. He's he's buff. He's charming. He's funny. He's Terry Crews. Yeah. I think you're in love. I think I. <laughs> I think everyone, male, female, whatever. I think everyone's in love with Terry on some level. How could you not be? So you're the only female on the show. No, I'm. Um. Well, it depends on the episode. This okay. episode, it's me and um, Cameron Esposito is the other girl, and then uh, Kurt Bronner is the other panelist. Mm -hmm. So there are three panelists every uh, show, and it rotates. Mm -hmm. So what about? Yeah. What's your opinion about women in comedy? Um, oh, mm. well, it's interesting. You know, sure. they talk about the Daily Show, who might replace mm -hmm. John Stewart, right. and they now it's start like, to could it be a woman? Right, it's like, and they what make it sound like age are we living in? Yeah, <laughs> um, I think it's so weird that I think it's so weird that we're still having these conversations uh -huh. of like women in comedy. I mean, yeah, I guess there are less women in comedy, um, but it, I don't know why people are so surprised when a woman well, who's is funny. Well, who's tougher on women comedians, women or men? Oh, that's a great question. 
Um, I'm like, can we go to break? I don't know. Um, <laughs> no, I guess uh, probably, I don't know. It's probably, it's probably equal. Who Although, trolls the most? I will say, I think it's men. Men are harder on women, I think. Um, mm -hmm. I think there's jealousy there. I think I've definitely heard male comedians who are like, oh, well, you know, you probably got that because they just needed a girl. And it's like, yeah. or I'm funnier than you. Like, mm -hmm. that is a possibility that that... Yeah, is a reality. You, say, you know what? But I got it. Yeah, it is. <laughs> it's, it's mine. A, it is a weird thing. I actually, stay think, over there. I'm over here. Yeah. Well, right? women in comedy actually really he does do that all the time when he's angry. I, I just, just stay <laughs> over there. Stay over there. I'm angry, not there. here. Yeah. <laughs> all right. World's funniest fails. Yes. There's Terry Crews, who we were talking about right uh, there. What a hunk. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for calling me a hunk. Uh, <laughs> at eight, right here on Fox 11. Great. Thank you, Jamie. Yeah. Thanks. And we'll be right back.